What's up guys, welcome back. Or if you're new to the channel, welcome to Hub Up Fishing. We got Coda today on the boat. We're fishing at Allen Henry. It's a pretty day, a little cloudy. Water temperature 60.8 degrees. Should be climbing. Hopefully we slam some. My wife's stepdad caught a seven and a half pounder yesterday and a couple others. So let's see if we can do some damage. I don't know what I'm gonna start off throwing. Maybe Texas rig, lightweight. We'll see. We'll keep y'all updated. <laughs> Smell good. Okay, we'll let him go, okay? We'll let him go. Say bye. <laughs> Booyah. Texas Rig Cinco. What else do you think I caught him with? He's stuck on my. A row, son. Two in a row. That's a pretty baby largemouth. We will let her go. <laughs> See? 
See you later. Tore up two Cinco's in a row though. Thing about Cinco's guys are real expensive and they run out quickly. So let me throw another one on there, can you? There's a little mini school of them right here. I'm okay with catching babies, I'm bored. Of course we are recording. Get this guys. Hell yeah, dude. That's a spotted bass, looks like. On the chatterbait, guys. Oh, I hope I got that on camera. I don't think we did. We're terrible. My GoPro died two seconds ago. God. There's probably a whole school. Big one like the last one. I think I'm on a chatterbait pattern, baby. That's so baby. Cool deal, guys. Let's catch some more. And they were both in shallow ass water, like two feet of water. So I can't tell exactly what's going on. There he is. Oh, big fish, big fish, big fish, big fish, babe. Big fish, babe. Holy crap. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is a giant. This is a giant. Get the net, get the net. Get out of the tree, get out of the tree. Watch out, watch out. Oh, what the heck? Grab that, grab the net. Holy crap, it's a catfish. Holy crap. What the heck? Hit that record though. Coda, get back, you little hot ho. Oh my gosh. God. Dude, he freaking clobbered. It's a 10 pound catfish right here. Well, can I not catch a 10 pound bass, please? Coda, this thing will get you, dude. It'll no, hurt. Cody, Cody. Oh my. It came off his brown. What the heck? Let's get Snapchat out. Coda. I'm not a big listener. I don't know how you hold a catfish, man. <laughs> Coda. Look at this nasty thing. That's disgusting. On a chatterbait, guys. Ooh. On a chatterbait. Look at this. God. Gross. Give me a break. A catfish? On a chatterbait? Yeah, lame, man. Well, that's what a 10 pound bass feels like. He freaking, I mean, I can't even explain to y'all how hard that guy 
hit that bait. I mean, it was just the biggest thump you could ever feel in your entire life. So guys, I want to show y'all something. These Yamamoto's, the Zaykos, just kind of a little swim bait. I always pair, I mean, I did it randomly last year on a chatter bait and I love this purple. I'm not sure if y'all could see that. Paired up with the kind of little purple and crappie colored chatter bait. Man, I caught two of my biggest fish ever last year. And I just caught a big, what looked like a spotted bass, good three and a half, four pounds. So, and then I caught a 10 pound catfish on the son of a gun. You want to get in there perfect, straight as possible. I'm kind of shaking, my adrenaline's pumping. So I didn't do a very good job of putting it straight in there. But yes, I'm not sure if y'all can see that. Put it in the sunlight here. Chatterbait, a little bit of purple. That catches huge bass. I mean, I have a feeling this chatterbait's gonna end up catching my personal best one of these days. Just gotta put in the hours out here and chunk and wind it. Guys, Jerk bait time, baby. got him fired up now oh I'm shaking I can't I'm shaking guys that's that's a fatty that's a fatty yeah, wind is it's like a fatty guys that's my biggest fish on the jerk bait ever I mean I would call that a four and a half five pound just full of eggs small uh, spotted bass we're gonna go release her back into her home. I don't know if that's just been eaten or she's just full of eggs. Man, guys, Look. that was cool. One of my first ever. Whoa, that is cool. I get that in the camera. Let's see. Look at that, guys. Hey, Cody, get a little smell. Get a little smell. Is that good? You see everything? Get the release. Get back. I got it. He's going right to her spot. Okay, let me get another one. That was sick, guys. Hopefully, I got a skull fired up. I was too excited and everything was stuck. I was too excited, I had to get pictures. That was awesome. There's probably more and bigger ones in here. They may not even bite now. Let me just see what's going on. Oh, that was sick. The setup is perfect.
guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. Gonna have to vacuum out my boat now because of all the dog hair, but it was fun. We got Coda out of the house. He enjoyed it. He was a pain in the butt this morning mainly because he just had to pee. Because he peed for five minutes straight when we finally let him out. And then he was okay. Kinda. Until we caught fish. Then he was a pain in the butt again. But all in all, it was a good day. I'm very happy. And Alan Henry's a tough fishing lake though. It is tough. I can never seem to figure them out. But if I was throwing that chatterbait all day in this clear water, oh man, I would have, we'd have nailed them. We probably could nail them now, but I'm tired. We're gonna get out of here. We haven't even ate dinner. We got some good footage. We did miss, we missed that one fish on, on, we missed that first fish, but we made up for it with a jerkbait one. So, well guys, We'll see y'all on the next one. Work hard, play hard, hub up.